Tonight we've got a closer look at an incredible discovery made possible by researchers here in Rochester. Scientists have confirmed the existence of what's called gravitational waves. These waves are distortions in the fabric of the universe that happen when two large masses like neutron stars or black holes collide. In plain English, this discovery opens the door to a new way of studying the universe. And Jeff Rusak tells us how RIT helped with the discovery. It's easy to see the effects of gravity. It's easy to see that there are waves. It is not easy to see gravity waves. But now we can. This is what a gravity wave looks like. It may not appear like much, but the amount of work to get this graph is mind-boggling. About 10 years ago, researchers at the Rochester Institute of Technology wanted to know what it would look like when two black holes collided. Wait for it now. It was thought that the collision would create ripples in space-time, the fabric of the universe first theorized by a little someone named Albert Einstein. Researchers at RIT came up with this graph. Last year, LIGO, a tool located in Washington and Louisiana, used to measure the most astronomically minute movements detected this. Look familiar? It's exactly what researchers at RIT predicted. A gravity wave. Something that's never been successfully identified until now. It was like a miracle. Thursday, RIT celebrated their role in this momentous discovery. Uh, absent that previous work done by the RIT researchers, we would still be asking ourselves, what is the signal from? You can make predictions in science, but you actually have to see what you predicted. And that's what LIGO did today. It saw the predictions that, uh, that, that the RIT team had made 10 years ago. This is the dawn of a new era. This is opening a new, an entire new window into the universe. Thanks to research at RIT, and two black holes becoming one. Gravity, that invisible force that keeps us all grounded, is no longer invisible. Jeff Rusak, News 8.